Hey everybody. In this video I'm going to be talking about Google Chrome again. Well, I like Google Chrome because it is a decent browser. This browser has a serious issue. And that is memory consumption. Let's see, I have... Let's see, 4, 8, 12, 15 tabs open here. And on the other page, I have two windows open. I have six tabs open. So a total of 21 tabs. And the thing about Google Chrome is when you first open it, the memory consumption isn't that bad. But over time, it just gets where it eats up all the computer's memory. And this computer has 12 gigs of RAM. I have the virtual memory set to only. 400 megabytes page file because I want Windows to use more of the memory rather than the hard drive space swap space because of course memory is a lot faster than the hard drive is and we're using 10.5 gigs of RAM it's enough to trigger the um, overly active Windows warning that your computer's low on memory this triggers for some reason when there's only 10 gigs of RAM used that's, even though there's two more gigs of RAM available this pops up Anyways, here's a look at Task Manager. I also have Google Earth running, along with Firefox, Windows Movie Maker, and a few other little things. Let's go into the Processes tab and show you some details here. Okay, let's go ahead and browse through here. There's a total of 107 processes. And look at all these Chrome processes. And have a look here. This one is using over a gig of RAM by itself. So that's one tab using over a gig of RAM. That's sweater.com. Another one's using almost a gig. We've actually got, yeah, more than one process, um, actually about four or so using almost a gig of RAM, if not more than a gig of RAM. Which is absolutely ridiculous. We get notice when we look at Firefox, which is running one tab, it's YouTube.com. It's using 164K, 164,000K, I should say. Probably around 160 megabytes if you, if you translate it. Um, of course, compared to the junk load of memory that Chrome is using. Now, here's another funny thing. You know some of these tabs in Chrome are using over a gig of RAM. Let's go see how much memory Google Earth is using. 756,000K. So Google Earth, which is, you know, a graphical program that normally is a memory hog. And it's been up for quite a while, too. I have, I've had this um, program up for quite a while, too. It's using less memory than a web browser on one tab, weather.com or Facebook or something like that. And it's, it's ridiculous. Now just have a look here. I'm about to go ahead and close out Google Chrome. I got the um, task manager set to performance where you can see all the um, CPU and memory information. Let's go ahead and exit Chrome. Now the computer is only using a little over 3.5 gigs of RAM. So you do the math. Is that ridiculous or what? So right about six and a half gigs of RAM Google Chrome was using. I can load Firefox up with that many tabs and wait a few days. It might use one and a half gigs of RAM for that many tabs. But Chrome requires almost seven gigs to run that many tabs if you leave the browser open. And if I had left it open, it would just kept increasing and increasing. If this computer had 16 or 32 gigs of RAM, and if I was to leave Chrome open long enough, Chrome will probably use all that memory. So anyways, I urge you a fine example of Chrome's ridiculous memory usage. Any questions or comments, feel free to ask.